Hey guys, so it's a new vlog. I thought to start this vlog here. It started really late last night because I was busy watching series. I don't like watching series because it keeps me tied up and always want to watch what's next. Anyway, so I slept late, woke up early, and after school run, I said to go back to sleep. I wasn't really able to catch so much sleep, but at least I had about maybe 30 minutes of closed eyes or maybe one hour, and I feel better now. So I'm awake and I'm ready to start my day. Today, my workspace is empty because I'm just the only one here today. My tailor isn't going to be coming today, as well as Wura, who is my advanced student. So just me today in this workspace, all by myself. There's light, thankfully. I'm enjoying myself in this cool workspace. I just want to start doing some patterns and you know put cut if possible so i thought to start a vlog today hopefully i'll have a very productive day so just in case you're here for the first time please do click on that subscribe button if you like to see beautiful things okay and yeah let me just get on with my day so guys i am trying to recreate a dress i'm going to be leaving that dress on the screen i'm trying to recreate this dress here it's an actual kid dress as you can see and the corset dress as well but in this i'm going to be for this style i'm going to be recreating it using um a damask fabric one second let me see it so it's a similar color of fabric and it's brocade it has um this texture that also looks like an actual case so we're going to be working with this fabric for this style i'm really excited to get on with this dress it's going to be fabulous i may not be able to show you guys process in this video but because i'm trying to vlog my day so i'm going to be showing you guys or oh, I get up to with this dress, it may not be in this video, so do also check other videos if you want to see the finished finished look. Yeah. But another thing I wanted to show you guys is this very pretty applique that I got for this dress. So I got this really beautiful gold applique. Guys, this video video cannot even do this thing justice. Video cannot do it justice. But let me still try and show you guys. I may just come closer and show you people the details on this one. But this is the panel that i'm going to be using to embellish this one i'm going to get on with the pattern today i also have another dress a red dress i'll show you guys on the screen as well i want to make those two patterns today hopefully start cutting it and then we'll get it out of the way because this is really like an urgent order i'm trying to see if i can deliver it to my um, client on time i'm hoping that by the end of this week i'm done so that i can ship it to her in the us so that she can use her dress everybody's happy and i get good beautiful pictures as well i love pictures yeah my customers i don't send me pictures you guys i don't even know what to do i don't know i don't know what to say to you guys why 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 don't you want me to showcase the beauty <laughs> for the world <laughs> anyway so i'm going to just get on with this let me show you guys close up this the details on this one okay so this is it like see the details on this one it's so beautiful so 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 beautiful like this thing in person is much finer than this so let's just manage this video okay you can see all the all the um crystals going on here the stones and i love the fact that it's like three different shades of or is it three or two yeah three different shades of gold so there's champagne gold there's a much lighter gold i don't know if i'll call this cream this color right here and then there is there's even silver like they're just different colors so it's just going to pop well on the fabric so this is it on the fabric let's look and see this is it on the fabric like it's gonna pop it's going to pop okay why do i continue doing all this process i'm seeing now let me just let me just get on with it i'm already excited about this one so i'm, going to, I'm about to make so i'm about to start with my pattern right now Yeah. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah Please say any negative thoughts, I pop off when I hear people say I cannot I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong, I won't stop to the top So you better back off, I get lost I'ma stay loud, stay proud, never running out, never heading south I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth, can't put me down I'll be getting loud, you can never doubt, not what I'm about Have your f***ing cloud, it be raining now So this is my pattern, I'm done with it, this is the front Corset pattern. I'm using a bustier style. I'm not even done with this because I'm yet to um, contour the cup area. I'm going to contour it. I'm not yet done. And this one is the back. 
So it's going to have like a an open back here. This is like the back yoke. This is the back neck. This is the back bodice. And I also reduced the center back because I want it to be able to tie as much as like I want to have enough space for the modesty panel. And then this is the lower part of the dress. So I see I'm going to be doing this in the same format as I did. If you watch my previous vlog, you see that I did um, the skirt on top of the top as a dress. So I'm going to be doing the same thing here. I don't usually do a I don't usually do that on my um, lower part of my dress. So this is going to be going over this on the on the dress but i'm making it a process the process inner process as well for this style so i'm going to go ahead and start cutting this pretty fabric like look at how pretty this fabric is so lush yes yeah, so i'm going to go ahead and start cutting it so i'll catch up with you there I feel nauseous, believe me Never had a lot of sh** come easy Had to work hard, struggle just to be me Had to rise up just so they could see me Did what I had to do just to feed me And what was left over I put towards my dreaming But the only thing in life that has meaning Are the things you gotta work for, believe me Take into your hands a plan Your own hands can land your own brand And damn, I feel like no one takes accountability They want the credibility Convincingly unwilling to put in the f hours It takes to get some power Don't be f***ing sour Take a cold shower Scream until you're louder Work until you're prouder And f*** all the doubters They're just your downers I swear to God they all let me down I always fought just to wear the crown I'm off at these f***ing clowns Who were all taught they deserve an ounce It's only worth it if you work for it It's only worth it if you work for it I won't stop till they hear me now I won't stop till I wear the crown
making this dress um, as a um, a mini length um, dress so guys I'm trying to cut the overlap of this skirt having for the this is I'm having for the lower part I'm going to be using the um, appliques to line it here as is on the picture and then the line here to conceal the fact that there's no joining here as well so that's why I didn't cut this one as a as an overlap mm -hmm. how to line this because we have this extension coming out and I would like it to have the lining covering it up too. so this is the lower part of our dress it's looking good so I'm going, to, I'm going to go on to cut the lining and finish up the cutting of this dress so guys i am feeling myself because you know this girl is a fashion designer extra okay okay so i went ahead to practice the sleeve on a satin because i haven't done this kind of sleeve before so i went ahead to um, practice on a satin fabric and this is my sleeve it was looking like so far so it's looking almost like it i'm still going to walk around this to you know get it to be perfect and i'm going to be bringing it for as a tutorial on the channel okay but yeah i'm just trying to figure out this leaf probably take this in a bit more and then run the rest in like this uh am i not a fashion designer so this is what the sleeve is looking like right now this one is looking a bit shorter than what we have in the picture but now i know what to do with the sleeve this is a five layers of it and then it looks like there's a the shoulder pad i'll do this as a tutorial in another video but well, let me go ahead with the work so guys this is another day i'm still working on this dress and i wanted to show you guys the progress i told you guys i, I told i said i was not going to be showing a lot in this video because i'm actually in a hurry to get this done but our dress is coming up nicely like so nice look at that sleeve such a beauty this fabric is just doing this thing justice so i've placed i've put in this sleeve i'm going to put the skin mesh next and i will be rounding up with the top bit by putting in the bony later so it's 2 a.m here i just finished working on this dress that i showed you guys earlier i'm so tired but the beauty is staring at me and i want to show you guys this night it's noisy by the way <laughs> 